This is Ghana National College. When students, teachers, residents of campus take in products packaged with plastic, they end up littering the place with the plastic waste. Now you've been wondering if it's the duty of students of Ghana National College to be picking on campus. But the question is, after picking what's next? This is where the dump is ready to be buried. We came up with a project called Sanitation Alive, where we pick all these plastic waste and send them to useful products. After we are done gathering the rubbish, we wash it, dry it, process it, and it's ready for assembly. Hello, you are welcome to our workplace where we turn plastic waste into useful products. So I'll introduce you to the dustbin department. This is the dustbin department and what we do here is we use the plastic bottle bits collected to make dustbins in order to collect the rubbish we make here on campus. Also, as an initiative of sanitation in our life, we've made a lot of these dustbins to segregate the rubbish we make here on campus. I'll also introduce you to the vein liner department. We designed the vein liner for the dustbin department. As you can see, we use water sachets, a thread and a needle to form the vein liner for the effective collection of rubbish. We have next the power bank department. This is a powerful power bank designed by my team. And what we used in making this power bank is a 9 volt battery, which we connected 3 in series to obtain 27 volts. And we connected it to this component of a sport charger head and placed it in this plastic case, beautifully designed out of plastic waste. This power bank can be used to charge your phones and other electrical accessories. We have next the pencil case department. This is the pencil case department where we make our pencil cases from our plastic waste collected by cutting them, sewing zip to it, and painting them into our finished products. We use these pencil cases in storing our pencils, sharpness, erasers, and also used in our offices in storing our pen drives. And they can be used as money boxes. You are welcome to the umbrella department. Here in the umbrella department, we sew together connected sachet rubbers using a thread and a needle. After getting a bigger piece of the sachet rubbers, we attach it to the base of the umbrella using glue. And this gives us the final product, which is the umbrella. And it makes it ready for the market. Here are the touch light departments. We produce touch lights. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, a lot of students are taking immune boosters which come in these containers. As innovators, we thought of how to put these containers to use. We decided to use this as a body for a such light. We made use of a simple circuit which consists of an LED, a switch, batteries. All that we put into this plastic case to produce a such light. Now the question is, why should waste go waste? This led the team to use plastic waste gathered from the campus to produce artifacts like board bin, bin liners, pencil cases, touch lights, and umbrellas in a quest to mitigate burning, which could lead to emission of toxic gases into the atmosphere and could deplete the ozone layer. Hey boys, you, share girl share for our newfound vision of recycling plastic waste this year. Sanitation. Our life.